Lisa. I can't believe the day is finally here. Everyone that's here today and everyone that knows you understands how beautiful you are, both inside and out. I'm in awe of the Lord's kindness and faithfulness throughout our journey. I'm blown away that he's paired me with my perfect match. Yes, our love may appear unconventional because it's not what you see on Instagram or on TV. But our God makes no mistakes. I repeat, our God makes no mistakes. Amen. Amen. A cord of three strands is not easily broken. Through this marriage, many will be inspired. Amen. Through this marriage, perceptions will change. Mm -hmm. Through this marriage, the world will see a glimpse of heaven. Amen. This love will Amen. change the world. Amen. Amen. My prayer for today and every day of our lives is that God will be glorified. I pray that I'm the place you come to when you're feeling the weight of the world. The place you come to when you receive the best news ever. And even the place you come to when you just want someone to wipe the makeup off your face. That's right. Mayfair. I'm committing to loving you, honoring you, and cherishing you. I'll always remember a conversation we had with, with mom, your mom, when she reminded us that love is not just a feeling, it's a decision. Today and always may fair, I commit to choosing you. With my body, I honor you. All that I am, I give to you. All that I have, I share with you. Within the love of God, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Winston, I still remember the point at which I realized that our connection was about so much more than just business or even friendship. I remember when I first decided to pray about us. I imagined my prayer would go something along the lines of me asking God to give me a sign that you were the man he had for me. But instead I find myself asking God that he give me the grace for this relationship because truly I never needed a sign. Your whole being has been a testament to God's unfailing love towards me. His unwavering hand over my life and a confirmation that truly, this is of God. I love you, Winston. And on this day, my vow to you is that this will always be my first ministry. I will be faithful to you as long as we both shall live as husband and wife, that no matter where our life together takes us, no matter what opportunity is called, no matter how numerous the demands of life become, I will always be your help me. I will always be in your corner and I'll always follow you as you follow Christ. Till death do us part, according to God's holy law. And this is my solemn vow. Just a short prayer after hearing those words. Heavenly Father, by your blessing, let these vows be to Ben and Mayfair, a symbol of unending love and faithfulness and of the promises they have made to each other through Christ our Lord. Amen.